protein powder. I made a promise to myself that in order to buy the protein powder that I love, which is the diesel brand, I need to use this one first or else it's a waste of money. So just as a heads up, this is the brand that I'm using and I will let that focus for you viewers because it's not good. It's mango flavor and it's sweetened with monk fruit so it's naturally sweetened. It's all my style. I love mango and I love things that are naturally sweetened. And the girl was like, oh it tastes like juice. Which it does taste like juice, except the fact that it's clumpy and I don't like things that are clumpy. I think that is really gross. So I'm like, bah. So anyways, I'm almost done this torture. Can you see? However, something that's not clumpy that I use every day, shameless plug, is my greens powder from Teamy. So I use that every day and it's not clumpy and it is the consistency of juice and I just put it with water and I just get her down. I use that every morning. It's fantastic. And I have a discount code, so like, that's fantastic. So you can use TOFA25 for 25% off. You just have to do a minimum order of $29, which is easy to spend. But I'm currently waiting for, um, it's like aloe, I don't even know what it would be called. Hydration gel, that's what it was. Hydration gel, and then I got a new, um, what word am I trying to use? Face, why can't I talk? Face cleanser. That's what I'm waiting for. So like, hydration gel and face cleanser, super pumped about it. So anyways, I'm gonna make some food, cause I'm hungry. I just had that protein shake. Ew. Okay, real talk. I used to have those breakfast bowls all the time, like the vegan breakfast bowls with chickpeas and stuff. And then I went through a phase of not having it, but that phase I didn't film what I was eating. So now I'm going through that phase again and now I'm filming. So you're gonna think all I eat like on my channel for my whole life are these bowls, but it's really not the case. I went through a phase. I bought this guacamole in a large container because I used to buy those little snack pack ones and they were so expensive and then they like get old really fast and it just wasn't what I wanted. So, anywho, I'm gonna start making some food and then, <laughs> sorry Bane, it's okay, mom's just dropping stuff. Uh, but I'm gonna talk to you later because I have very exciting news and updates on my birth control. <laughs> And now I'm moving on to the watermelon. Look how good this watermelon looks. Like seriously, so amazing. Anywho, um, we actually cut up two giant watermelons and put them in that bowl, but like we've had people over and it's just like, it's such a fun thing to eat when it's so hot out. So it's just been going really fast. So I'm gonna put a little in a bowl because watermelon I have no control over. Like I used to cut watermelon in half, sit on the couch with a spoon and just eat it and that was dangerous. Uh, so I'm gonna actually put it in a bowl and make it like portioned. So that's, I just love fruit. Like fruit is my weakness. Like I would give up chocolate, sugar, anything like that, but like whole fruits and stuff like that. Oh my gosh. So good. This could be dangerous, but I'm gonna try bringing up the whole watermelon bowl up to my office and see how it goes. I just did the dishes so I didn't wanna like dirty another bowl. So it's like, Hashtag efficiency. So I totally forgot that I was vlogging and I'm just gonna make something to eat before I work out outside. No, my wrap has a hole in it. And that's like 
I don't know if you can see it. It's a decent size hole. Like if I put dressing on, which I will, that's not fun. I've never actually had a hole on these and I buy these all the freaking time. They are not gluten free though, I wish they were. And I talk about them legitimately all the time in my old vlogs, but they're the protein up wraps. And they only have uh, seven net carbs and 12 grams protein. I think I'm just gonna do like lunch meat, some lettuce from my garden, definitely cucumbers, cause cucumbers are life. Okay, so I got my protein up wrap. I'm just gonna cut some cucumbers up. I always slice them, I'm gonna show you this, it's kind of weird, but I always slice them in half and then I cut them so that it's like, I don't know, nice and thin and easy to eat. Cause I like a lot of cucumbers. And tonight, it's supposed to be a billion degrees. It's so hot, it's almost 40 degrees out right now. And I've just been staying inside working. But what I am gonna do is we're gonna load up the floating picnic table. We're gonna take it out with some friends. So that's exciting. We even had a boat before and we still always went on the floating picnic table. It's just like low key, super fun. I go through phases of everything I feel like. I don't know if anyone else does, but it's just like I either eat it all the time or I don't eat it at all. And I feel, I feel it deep in my bones that it's going to be a new phase for me to have these wraps. Oh, I forgot, okay. And I also use nutritional yeast instead of cheese. If you have not tried it yet, highly suggest. I actually have never tried it on like a cold salad or a cold wrap or anything, but in like hot food to die for. And it's so good for you. So it's awesome that it tastes like cheese and it's good for you. But I'm actually just gonna peel it up, but smells so good. If you can get past the fact that it looks like beta fish food, it's the best. It actually looks like fish food. Isn't that nuts? It does not smell like it though. Thank goodness. This one broke too. That is because of me though. It was a user error. It's gonna be so good. Do you want the end of my wrap? Easy. He's so gentle. He's so cute. Do you not like my wrap? Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, it had turkey in it. Oh, I love him so, so much. Hi, buddy. Hi. Okay, so let's chat about my little birth control update. I did have my appointment on Tuesday, so that was two days ago with my natural path. She is so awesome. She's like really sweet and like really honest if something is not gonna work or she doesn't think it's gonna work, she'll tell me. She's not like a really salesy person, which I appreciate because I've been a natural path where they're just like, Try this, try that, and you'll buy my fish oil pill. The one from Amazon isn't okay. So she recommended products because she's actually from back home. So that's seven hours away and I live up north. So she told me products that specifically I could get on Amazon, which appreciated that. So let me just bring it up. I will put uh, the links below to the products in case you're interested. So the first thing that she recommended was this Vitex. So what our plan is, this Vitex is going to be balancing my hormones out. So this is going to be like a critical part. So I'm gonna take one a day, every day, for three months. And then I'm going to also be taking this called Active B6 um, every day for three months as well. So the plan is one month I'm gonna be on birth control, Active B6, and Vitex all at the same time. I can consume it in the morning. After that month is over, I'm gonna scrap birth control, stop taking it, and just take the Vitex that is gonna balance my hormones out and the Active B6, which is gonna help with energy levels and things like that. So that's the game plan. I'm gonna go two months trying that with the medication, and then I'm gonna have an appointment with her to see how it goes after that, like how it's gonna progress. So it's like, she thinks that I'm gonna be able to get off of those uh, eventually, like after the three month mark, she thinks I might just need it just to kind of get through that time period. Curiosity has stricken, and I really wanted to know more about what the active B6 does. So I'm just reading it on Google here, and it says, it improves your mood and reduces symptoms of depression. Uh, so it plays an important role in mood regulation. And it's also, this is partly because this vitamin is necessary for creating the neurotransmitters that regulate emotions, serotonin, all of that stuff. So that actually makes sense, because now that I'm looking at this, I told her that last time when I tried to get off birth control, I was so, so depressed. Mood swings like crazy. I can't even compare. I've never felt that way ever in my life. And it was so unmanageable that it was like really depressing in itself, but then it caused depression too. So I thought, well, I don't wanna have depression if I'm off the pills. So she's gonna, well, not she, but I am going to take this active B6 and that will help with that. So that's cool. So it's like the active B6 is for your mood and depression. And then the other one, the Vitex is actually for your hormones to balance them out. 
I find this stuff so interesting, like, honestly. And it's like when I go to a doctor, like a normal, like family doctor or something, they just like brush you off or try to give you medication or just something. But she's like working with me and I'm just like excited. It feels so good because I've wanted to get off this for quite some time. So to actually have a plan with my naturopath who I like really, really appreciate and like look up to, it's just like the perfect world. So I want to share my experience with you guys. I want to show you whether this B6 and this Vitex works for me, especially if you've had similar issues. Then I don't know, you can just like follow my story, check it out, maybe try it yourself. They're natural anyways, so it's like I don't really see the harm in trying them. They're available on Amazon, so they can't be that crazy. Um, but anyways, yeah, just watch my experience as I go. I'll let you know, but it's going to be like progressively through these vlogs because I, I want to make the vlogs still about my life and my nutrition, health, all that stuff. Uh, but I definitely still want to incorporate this new part of my life since this is going to be a big part. So I can't freaking wait! Thank you.